So guess what? This is your least favorite part. I don't really like this area. <laughs> How did I know? Oh. Hi. Actually, I think... Oh, great. Again? Wow. So I think the next area that I like is maybe the castle. That's a long... Which we're not going to see for like a couple hours. Yeah, that's, that's a long way away. Any time there, butthole. Is it, give her, give him time. Can stabby, you poison him? Stabby, stabby. It doesn't matter. I don't know if you can poison him. Let's not find out. No, no, it's not worth it. All right. You tried. Right. Yep. Got a little scary there at the end, but you tried. He definitely took quite a bit of health out. Oh boy, a single human effigy. It's usually what you get from beating NPC invaders. Uh, take that trick. I like I like the loud sound that his hammer makes whenever it hits the ground. <laughs> is that more poison? Uh, it's a lot of poison. Yeah. Just pretend okay. everything is. Okay, everything's poison. That gear is poison. Oh. Uh, that was poison. Good shot. <laughs> I like his spear. So these guys are called Grave Wardens. Mm -hmm. uh, and if you're wondering where the grave is, uh, it's not. Oh, there is no grave. Uh, okay. There is way later. After oh, okay. the castle. <laughs> I always got confused by these guys because I thought they were gorillas at first. Because an item that you can get from them is the silver black stuff. Mm -hmm. But I always read it as silver back. Oh. Like a gorilla. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I was dumb. I still am. Are you missing something? Or just because you said silver back? Uh, yeah. Okay. There's an L there that I missed for like ever. <laughs> So, I don't like these guys. No? They have way too much health, too. Yeah, that's pretty nasty. And they're headless. Uh, you can actually get a mannequin head to wear later. Oh, I don't good. know where it comes from. <laughs> and, all right. So, I mean, there's no good reason to shoot these guys, but hey... Why I'm you, here. Have, you have the option. And back over. <laughs> and back over. Good. One down. Okay. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I missed one of these up. Oh, no, I guess that's later then. <laughs> All right, good. <laughs> this place is also like a maze. Yeah. There are quite a few areas to get lost in. Good. Always fun. Hello. I'm glad he didn't break that chest. He can do that? Yeah. Oh. Let's just say that happens later. That sucks. A lot of shit happens in this LP. <laughs> um, so you can use a bonfire ascetic, because it sort of puts the place to New Game Plus, mm -hmm. and it doesn't do shit. Oh. So I have... So when they break the chest, it turns into rubbish. So whatever item was in there, you don't get now. Oh, and you can never get. Um, maybe if you do, like, a legit New Game Plus instead of a bonfire ascetic. Yeah. But let's just say I get two rubbishes later. Oh, well, that's terrible. Goodbye. Oh, bye. Whoa, he fell fast. So this is really unintuitive, but yeah. I'll, I'll light the bonfire that's right here first. That's probably a good idea. So the boss that's coming up is in a room filled with poison. Literally filled with poison. Oh. Well, the floor is covered in poison. Yeah. Literally covered in poison. Oh, good. 
So the only way to get rid of most of the poison is to burn this windmill. Makes sense. No, it doesn't. It also gets rid of a lot of poison down on the ground level. Yeah. So you burn it, and eventually it stops. <laughs> okay. Uh, eventually. Yeah. There it goes. Uh, there we go. Alright, good. <laughs> so, I'm already gonna mess this up, because it's not worth it, but the guy who just went running up there... He's going to lock a door behind him. Oh. In fact, I just heard it close. Great. I don't know who I'm looking for. <laughs> but that's the door that he locked. Yeah. So there are a bunch of enemies up here that weren't normally here in the original. Good. Thankfully, you shoot one and they don't all come after you. <laughs> that would be pretty bad. Somehow I hit him. Holy shit. Yeah, that doesn't make sense. Alright, good. One down. Uh, it seems I'm not the only one who's firing at them from here. S seems like a smart way to do it. Where is he going? He's gonna go lock the other door. There is no other door. <gasps> Alright. Uh, it's a little close. Oof. And the other one's right above me. Ah. Uh, the, the other one's right above me. Good. Falling down that staircase is totally intentional. Yeah, it keeps uh, It from... makes the next boss easier uh, if you <laughs> manipulate the RNG. <laughs> so why didn't that thing drop down? Why didn't what drop down? The mannequin. He just did. Yeah, but why didn't he drop down before you shot him? So nobody cares. Okay. They Good. actually, they don't drop down. They drop up. Oh. If you oh. climb the ladder to the right and you walk down to the next area, all three come at you at once. Okay, good. Good to know. Shit, I just missed. Yep. It's okay, he's dead. Well, they were never really alive. And now I have a mask. Oh, so you can now look like you're headless. No, it's got a face on it. Oh. <laughs> That's the creepy part. Oh, yes. And for some reason, mannequin is spelled all weird. Well. Oh, look, there's the boss. Area, the... fog door. Oh, I was going to say, you can see the boss? The boss is, uh... Well, she's something weird. <laughs> of course. Yeah, so I wanted to make sure I wasn't near all that fire. Yeah, that's pretty nasty. Did the mannequin give you poison? Uh, yeah, their blades do poison. Um, okay. I think it, it's it's maybe just their uh, throwing knives, but it might also be the blades. Okay. Which is also not cool. Yeah. So, if you want to poison an enemy, in the original version, there are two of the flamethrowing ladies that are right here by these pots. Mm -hmm. And if you use a crossbow on them, they back up into the pots and they poison themselves. <laughs> That's who I was oh. waiting for. Yep. Oh, look, he has your mask on. Yeah. So he's doing bleed damage. health. Uh, he's like zero health. Well, now he, now he has zero health. But he had like zero health. Oh, okay. After those first three or so hits. <laughs> so here's one of these guys uh, right up close. How good. They have another attack that's really not cool, and it's like a close range explosion. <laughs> Fun. You can see why I might not like that. Yeah, that would... That would suck. Oh. What's that? You know what that is. Yeah, I know what that is. But do you know what that is? Oh. Pretty sneaky, sis. 
Not that. Oh. And I insist. <laughs> but do you know what this is? Oh, pretty sneaky, sis. Get your fucking sis. <laughs> So, there's been an enemy we haven't seen yet that you've been waiting to see for quite a while. Yeah. Can you guess what it is? It's not the fungus. It's not. It's the... It's back amorphic... there. I can see it. Can you see it? Is it the amorphic thing? The what? I don't know. Okay, just gotta wait. Yep. I hear another one. Do you see the enemy? Oh, the mimic. It's right there. It's right in the middle of the floor. Yeah. Good old mimics. And the thing with the Scholar of the First in addition is that some of the mimics are the same. Like, this one is always a mimic. Mm -hmm. Some of them they moved. Oh. Well, at least somebody stabbed it and then immediately died. So, don't attack it from the back, because it will pull you to the front and kill you. Oh. That's what that guy just did. Yeah. Also, don't do that. If you don't think you're going to kill it, let it poison itself! <laughs> Wonderful. Also, the work hook is pirate hook. Oh. And okay. that, that door of Ferris just, like, pours water on the ground. That's it? That's it. It's, it's not worth it. Some of them are tricks. Good. So, we are... We're right next to the boss, and we already got that bonfire right there. Nice. But we are... We're maybe halfway done with exploring this top area. Oh. I still gotta deal with all that fire. Well, that's one of them. There's another one hiding out. That's the explosion. Yeah. Oh. Don't go near there. No. This is why I don't like close range combat with these ladies. That's pretty awful. Oh no. It's fine. Was that your intent? Well, it doesn't matter. I need to go down here anyway. Okay. Because this leads to another area. Mannequin top. Okay. Shields just floating around. <laughs> Why not? There's an area a bit later where uh, I kill some enemies and their shields just fly. <laughs> like they're gone. Just gone. <laughs> Great. Can you get him? No. Nope. He can't get me. Yep. Um, these guys can also use Estus, if you let them. Oh, that's always fun. He didn't get a chance. And I got the mask, so now I can wear a rag on my face. Great. Awesome. Well, surprise, I guess. <laughs> and here comes the explosion. I'm really hoping she doesn't use that near the chest that she's at. Oh, yeah, bad. Okay, Which I'm pretty sure is a trap chest. Even better. Come on, poison. Shit. I guess it depends on... What? It doesn't what depend on anything. No? Okay. It's completely random. I could have died before that chest, gone to it again. Would have been something different. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, shit. Oh, surprise. I didn't know he was going to be there. Nope. <laughs> Just waiting for you. I guess healing's out of the question. Uh, now you can heal. So, I never like going after this. Because that's a really tricky jump. Yeah. Like, I have to aim towards the ledge. And I don't want to be on the ledge with this guy. No. <laughs> but he keeps putting his shield up. So maybe if I hit him in the knee. Yeah, shoot him in the kneecap. No, it's still not doing the damage. <laughs> uh, 
Oh well, here we go. Uh, this will be fun. See, getting there is the easy part. Getting back is not. Yeah. Also, oh no 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 no. Oh, oh, that's bad. Oh my god. Whoa. <laughs> that was. Oh my god. That was fun. Only ten more. I can't keep fucking up like that. <laughs> and it wasn't worth it. Great. Oh, uh, good. Is this worth it? No. No. So you can see it's a little weird and awkward jumping back. Because mm -hmm. i got to use this ledge. Yeah, you got it. That wasn't so bad. <laughs> I'm so anxious that there's another shadow guy. Or a mannequin. Yeah. But the fact that we went this way means that we get to talk to a special friend. It's your buddy Pate. Hey, Pate. Did you run into your friend? This is my friend. No, did he run into his friend? He doesn't know what a friend is. Oh, okay, good point. His friend is Creighton. Yes, his friend is great. They're not friends. They're on not a break. They're hot, yes. It's hard to know who to even trust these days. For instance, I've heard that a man is out for my life. Yes. So if you want uh, any sort of storyline for NPCs, this is basically it. Oh. <laughs> Off the top of my head, I can't think of any ones that actually have a quest line. No. Except for like one, but he just wants you to kill people. <laughs> for trust. Thing. Are you... is that a warning? You be careful too. And it's a boring warning. <laughs> so yeah, you can come from this entrance and he'll just say, oh, There's a treasure on the other side and I don't know how to get to it. Mm-hmm. Oh no. Oh. It's starting off fun. I can't back up too much because there are other mannequins behind me. Of course there are. Oh my god. Oh, Stop. wow. Well then. <laughs> That's bleed for you. Yeah. That was pretty nasty. Uh, yeah. And there's also... Did I really pull his aggro? That far out? Must have. Oh, I can't really tell. I think he's just being dumb. He's just pacing. So I'm gonna shoot the other one in his not face. Yeah. Good. And one more. Uh no, now one more. Oh. Oh no. Oh wow. <laughs> I did it. <laughs> oh man. That was scary. That was stupid of me. <laughs> He's, this guy's just pacing. He's just pacing. I don't know why that backstab didn't work. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of sucks. I like how he was just walking the four corners of that room. Yeah, he's a bit of a weirdo. <laughs> so to get an item, you actually have to raise this elevator, and then don't go on it. Oh. So you gotta get the item and then run to the stairs or you die. Cause that thing yeah. comes back down. Of course it does. I've always kind of wanted to wait underneath it to see how that would look. <laughs> see what happens when you die? Yeah, when you get crushed by that thing. Mm -hmm. The only problem is this area sucks and I wouldn't want to go through it again. <laughs> that makes sense. Uh, he's just chilling. He's not that fat. He's, no, he's not. <laughs> and off the edge. Yep. Bye. So you like Irish people, right? Yeah. Shush. You idiot. Stay quiet. I'm on the run. Don't he's so fat he's holding his belly. He's wow, yeah. That's pretty fat. He's pregnant with a fat baby. Yeah. <laughs> Why else Food, be here? baby. It's got death written all over it. Yeah, because I've been 
dealing out death. This whole game has death all over it. Kind of. <laughs> oh, there are yeah. blood pools everywhere. There really are. So this guy is, uh, he's a ladder smith. Oh, he makes ladders. That's it. Yeah. Good. Downright rude, really. I've got a soft heart, so. This guy also has maybe the most Irish name. <laughs> All right. Oh, it's not too bad. Uh, later, he asks for like twelve thousand. That's worse. Also, the he's the only guy that has a non-boss cutscene in the middle of this game. Nice. That I know of. And his belly clips through the rest of his he's belly. He's a big old fatto. <laughs> Uh, go on ahead. I won't offer this to him twice. Yeah, he'll offer it four total times. <laughs> uh, At least he is. wasn't lying. What do you need now? Huh? His name is Gilligan. Nice. I like you, Gilligan. You're my kind of Irishman. Drunk. Drunk. Yeah, same thing. he sounds intoxicated. <laughs> So here we get the black leather stuff, which is what I wore through most of the original Dark Souls. <laughs> <laughs> he also has this weird memento thing. Which is actually very important that you get. If yeah. you want to do an NPC quest line later. Oh, okay. It's a good thing I got them now. So let's see what 2000 Souls got me. Okay, it's not terrible. No. It's pretty terrible. Well, now you've got two Ferris Lockstones. I should probably have more than that. Oh. I should have like 32,000 at this point. Oh. Yeah? What is it? <laughs> what do you need That's uh, quite a lot. Yeah, it's just a little. Okay. I was farming. Have you mm -hmm. you got 32,000. Well, <laughs> apparently, there's this... Monster lady, right? Right. And the poison and does wonders for her body. Yeah, sure. Uh-huh. You know, uh -huh. health and beauty. So what he's describing is if you don't stop the windmill, the boss room is filled with poison, and she constantly heals herself. Ah. Uh. So you are always taking damage. She is always healing. Yep. That'd be awful. She was led to the prince of that nearby castle. What castle? Yeah, seriously. It's, it's um, not Drain Lake Castle, I can tell you that much. <laughs> the princess was desperate and saw eternal beauty. So at the same time, he's describing the next boss, the next old soul boss, and I think the covetous demon? Nice. I think the prince is the covetous demon, the princess becomes the queen, who becomes the next boss. And then the king no. is the king that we fight later. When do you think oh. this all happened? Good. No. We fight at least three kings in this game. This very land and in the DLC, I think we fight even more. Even this better. <laughs> Countless kingdoms have risen and fallen on this Like the four kings, place. only there are more of them. It's more like three this kings and three queens? Yo. There's at least three queens. Nice. One of them is in the DLC. <laughs> Alright. She's going to get us all burnt. God almighty. Oh, I'm so fat. I like how he goes from arms crossed to holding his belly when he's talking. God. Back to arms, back to holding. Yeah, back, back to, to arms. arms. <laughs> He's a peculiar man. He's... he's interesting. He's also a fat man. He's very fat. That mannequin is stuck in the wall. <laughs> he just really likes that wall. There are better ways to show your affection. I don't know, pacing the wall is a pretty good way to show your affection. I'd also like to remind you that every time you hear me enter a new area and you hear a thunk, that mm -hmm. is the dead bodies being spawned into the area. Okay, good. And... There we poison. go. 
So remember that lady with the fire that we couldn't get to? Yes. You found her. She's been on this ledge. <laughs> Fantastic. She's only here in Scala the First Sin. I just... Why? They, they gotta make it tough. It's not tough. It's annoying. <laughs> it is annoying. Is there anything good up here at least? Yeah. Magic okay. defense. Oh, that'll be good. Hey, Gilligan. Goodbye. <laughs> He'll move to Majula soon enough. Fair enough. There's so many people we can move there. There's actually achievement around it. Oh, yeah? I think there's... Let's see. Counting the people already there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine people? Wow. That's a lot. Yeah, it's a bunch. Yep. Now I'll move to that pseudo town. I didn't forget about this guy. Not again. <laughs> no. What? What is happening? How did he do that? What is happening? He's just—he's jumping past you. Well, good to know she's still angry. <laughs> and you've got a friend. Yeah, don't try to pull both of these guys at the same time. No. It's not recommended. No, that can't be fun. That was also an accident that worked out perfectly. Oh. So she moved. Yep. That was close. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, hey, how's it going? Oh, oh no. no. I'm surprised it didn't take him out. I kind of wish it did. Yeah. Yikes. It's away from me. And we also got a pretty good ring. Ooh. Which I don't know if that's a random drop or what. It doesn't seem like it. No. Shouldn't be. But not gonna complain regardless. I saw he went for the S. Yes, thing. he did. We also got the silver black spear. <laughs> At least you can read now. I can. I'm so proud. <laughs> All right, boss time. Uh, I mean, yeah, but oh. that's my feelings towards the boss. Yeah. So she's holding her own head. She's also a snake lady. Okay, good. Fantastic. She also sometimes throws her head, and then it explodes like a grenade. Does... wait. Does her head come back? She has to jump after it. Okay. She should do it. She normally does it when she's at low-ish health. Mm -hmm. She'll also use her tail to wrap you up and squeeze you. Oh, good. Can she petrify you? Because she kind of looks like Medusa. No. Okay. She's Mitha, the Baneful Queen. <laughs> and it's really hard to tell, but when she jumps back, she does heal a little bit. Yeah. In that poison. So yeah, if you are a ranged fighter, this fight is incredibly easy. I'm can imagine. If you summon even one person, this fight is a joke. <laughs> yeah, this, this doesn't look too bad. I'm sure it's much worse if there's poison everywhere. Oh, it's... I don't... I have never beaten her when there's poison all over the place. Yeah. And there it is. And then she jumps. <laughs> well, my plan to win right away. Spoiled. <laughs> Yeah, it's better to tank the hits. Yeah. That was easy. Still a lot of blood stains everywhere. Yeah, there are. So, what did I say was at the top of this windmill? Nothing. Keep that in mind. Okay. Because this is where it gets weird. Oh, good. It's an elevator. 
going up to nothing. You'd think? <laughs> Because even if it's not entirely clear how far up we were when we got into the elevator, I'm pretty sure this next part isn't possible. Okay. Because it's a long way up. We're still going. Yes. This is a long way up. This looks different from the rest of the castle. So welcome to the Iron Keep, which is filled with fucking lava, and it's a giant castle. I'm sorry. What? How? <laughs> it makes no sense. Welcome to Dark Souls 2, where the geometry is made up and the souls don't matter. Oh, <laughs> you're funny. 